Hey there, friends. How's it going? My name is Creepy Guy in a Chair, and uh, it's 9:59, and I'm about to go thieving. I think this is Thief Simulator. Welcome. <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna be doing, but let's just jump right in. I guess. Like everything in life, I just jump in without learning anything, and then complain that I don't know what I'm doing later on. <laughs> oh, Vinny, really? Now? Hey, it's me, Vinny. Why do Vinnies always sound like Vinnies? Why can't they pick up and be like, uh -huh, it's me, Vinny! They always sound like hardened criminals. If there's any Vinnies in the comments, leave a comment so I can know what you sound like. The Lombardis paid your bail. Oh, come on, Vinny, be more stereotypical. Okay, there is no jump. I think I'm stuck. I don't know how to progress any further. Equip the crowbar. Why are you putting the feckin' instructions on the ground over here? <laughs> oh, hello, person. What do you get up to on your free time? Just standing there? Yeah, that's cool. He didn't see me. In a second, I'll just talk to Vinny here. Hey, some dope left a flashlight on the ground. Wait, how did Vinny know there was a flashlight on the ground? I didn't even pick up on that. I'm too tired to realize that this makes no sense. All right, never mind. Let's break into this house. Very quietly. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, what is it, Vinny? Jesus Christ. Why don't you just rob the place? You seem to know what you're doing. Oh, I can hide under the bed. I could literally be a monster under the bed. Yeah, rob the teapot. Why not? I hope there's tea in it. Another pot. Yeah, I go for it. Why am I just stealing all their kitchen utensils? An old toaster. What the hell is he doing? What is it, Vinny? Time to bail, man. I stole two pots and thirty dollars. Wait, the front window was just feckin' open? Why didn't I just go in there in the first place instead of shattering their back window and making noise? Oh yes, parked up here. Not suspicious at all. Should we go? Can I drive? I left my boot open, but I'm sure that'll be fine. I'm a rich thief. I could get it repaired if anything breaks. These pens are worth their weight in gold. There we go. Mission complete. Thief by night, chef by day. <laughs> Arrives to the kitchen with new utensils every day. I don't even have a bed. I should be stealing beds, not pots and pans. Tools for thieves let you buy new kit online. Isn't this kind of leaving a paper trail if I'm buying stuff from tools for thieves? Can I not just go to a hardware store? I don't even have $20 to buy a lockpick because all I did was steal old toasters and pots and pans. Buy hints for Greenview 109. These guys just gave out tips for free. Logged in as Thief321. <laughs> Jesus, this guy's really making it black and white for when he eventually gets caught. Uh, no, that was a typo. Then why were you buying stuff from Thieves for Tools? Uh, I was doing it ironically. <laughs> Pawn shop, oh, good. What will you give me for an old toaster? Teapot, $8, yeah, sure. Old toaster gets me $3. Saucepan, 8 You know what? I did better than I thought I would. God, he looks like a ghoul or something. He's really creepy. He's got that dead stare. He's not even looking at me. He's looking at that guitar. Oh, what I wouldn't give to be back on the stage again. Oh, no. He looks in my direction, but not at me. I just think he doesn't like eye contact. I'll, um, see you later. Creepy fecker. Oh, God. I was supposed to go to the house. Okay. I, I gotta steal a TV for this Vinny guy. Oh, nice car. I should be stealing that. Wonder how many pots and pans he had to sell to get that. Wait, I should probably park around back. It would probably be a bit less obvious rather than just staying right in front of their house. Broad daylight, just smashing the fence apart. To be fair, I had to break into my own house through the back door before with a floodlight and I brute forced the back door down and there wasn't a peep. No one seemed to care. I guess my neighbors just don't like me. Front door key. Awesome. Now I can definitely convince them that I live here if they find me. I'm just a crowbar collector who lives in the neighborhood. What's your problem? <laughs> Let me call up my friend Vinny. He'll vouch for me. <laughs> oh, leaving their money down by the trash. Put it at really awkward places to get, don't they? It's like, oh, where will I leave this money? I just put it by the trash or down on the uh, lowest shelf in the house. There we go. God, I wonder how much I'll get for this. Seems like quite the marvel of new technology, if you ask me. I don't know where my home is. That's the only problem. I've been in so many homes. I start to lose track of what's mine and what isn't. The thief life is consuming me. Oh no, it's out this way, okay. Oh my god, Vinny, give me a moment of peace, Jesus Christ. Sixty dollars? That's not bad. God damn it, this guy would have bought my pot and saucepan for way more. Alright, I'm not going to that pawn store anymore. Break their dishes, that's my new job, alright. I'm telling you, revenge is a fool's game. Okay, 110, it's out this way. Right next to the house I just robbed. They do say that people return to the scene of the crime. Okay, window's still open. This is the house I already robbed, I think. 
This will take their shit again. They've replaced all their stuff and I'm just taking it again. Alright, this will show you. Alright, Vinny, the job's done. Wait, I gotta go back into 109? Why do I keep just robbing these two houses? What does Vinny have against these people? They're just trying to live their lives. And they just repaired that fence too. <gasps> A pot. I need to sell that on the internet. There's some guy who'll pay big money for this for some reason. Be cheaper to just order them on Amazon, but whatever. Just breaking their windows for no reason now. I could have just opened that, but I smashed it, then opened it. Like, it looks like they're having a hard enough time as is. They don't have the best houses that are in the best condition or anything. And I'm just making their lives a whole lot worse. All because of this Vinny guy. Look at this, I have tons of money now. <laughs> I've stolen just the right things. For a real job, you gotta scope the joint. Okay, I don't mind spying on a few people. I'm not above that. I'm not above much by the looks of it. My guy seems to have no moral compass, and that's coming from me. Oh, god damn it. I'm damaging my car. <laughs> At least car repairs are a lot cheaper than, say, uh, an old toaster. <laughs> ah, this is the Idol family. She's still there from three days ago. The routine is discovered. They just stand around. Oh, she's leaving, I think. They don't even see me over this fence, even with my phone going off. Jesus, even a neighborhood watch would come in handy here. I've just been robbing three houses in a row here. <laughs> Sleep in the car at the parking lot to pass the time. <laughs> Look at him, just bammed off. Time of his life. No, I think I'll just wait, thank you. I think he's gonna leave. Oh, no, he sat back down. You know, maybe I will take you up on that. Jesus Christ, he just lingers there. So this is the life of an NPC, huh? I definitely wouldn't want to be in this game if I were an NPC. Pretty much rather be in anything else. Box with shady content. Oh, radio. Someone's looking for that on the, the internet. I'll take that. Hopefully no one sees me. All right, everyone has left the area. I can probably take the TV too. I just don't want them to have any entertainment, you know? I think it's actually helping them because they just feckin' linger in their house all day. It would be good for them to get out and about. I'm the good guy here. <laughs> Got some serious mental gymnastics to come to that conclusion. God, you'd think they'd be suspicious of me at some point. Just getting in and out of my car, sleeping in my car outside their house. Um, let me sell you a saucepan, an old toaster, and another saucepan. I sell, uh, toasters and saucepans. I just, uh, I get rid of the old ones for the owners. Alright, I gotta go. Something tells me he won't believe my story, but at the same time, something tells me he won't care. <laughs> Sell the radio. Oh, microwave 180. Jesus Christ, there's a high demand for shitty food. God, I'm hitting one house after another. You'd think at some point the police would be like, there's gotta be a pattern here. He went to 109, 110, 111. But where could he go next? <laughs> they posted just one guy on the next house in the row. They'd probably get me. Break a window in 112, then hide or run away. Can I knock people down? Pedestrian was hurt. Load checkpoint. Okay, I'm a bad guy, but I'm not that bad of a guy. Take that guy who hit me with car. You're worse than this guy in the game. I feel like I should tell you because I, I don't bring it up that much, but I got hit by a car in real life. That's why I say things like that. And uh, I'm just really brave. Like my mom said, I'm a soldier. Okay, she didn't. That was a joke. But in all seriousness, the person in the hospital when I got put in there, when she asked me what happened, she went, Oh, wow, like a stuntman. And I was just like, no, I'm pretty sure the stuntman's supposed to be okay afterwards. And she was like, oh, yeah, I suppose. <laughs> ah, ah, no. Oh, God, she's called the police. I'm panicking. I don't know. Oh, God, run away. I'm innocent. You will never catch me. Oh god, they're gonna catch me. They're coming this way. Just go off road. Oh shit. 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 Go out of my way. Okay, good. I can load checkpoint now. <laughs> I have found a loophole. Okay, good. I'm just outside the house now. Throw bricks. I kind of like that ability. You see, all these seem really useful except for throw bricks, but I really want to throw bricks. Can I get that one, please? Request done. The police were called. Either run or hide. Huh, huh, huh. I can't fit in there. There's gotta be a place to hide here somewhere. <laughs> Terrifying feckin' everyone. I left my car out there. Freeze! Oh my god, where did you come from? I hope he gets his own cop show. He did well. I'm not going home empty handed. This coffee machine is mine and this toaster is mine. I mean, may as well make the most of it, right? There we go. Hidden in plain sight. Like the human trash I am. They'll open it and just be like, no, nope, definitely just trash in here. Close it and leave. God, they're kind of useless police, aren't they? All, they all just up and left. I couldn't find him in 30 seconds, folks. Sorry, we'll never catch him, even though his car is right here in front. We give up. Hello, everyone. I am from the car moving company. I am here to move this car. 
Oh, such a shame what happened to your family. I hate uh, bad people. <laughs> <laughs> Tear off the fake mustache and drive furiously away. <laughs> Look at these fabulous houses. These are the places I should be robbing. I should be stealing from the rich, giving to the poor. The poor being me, of course. Anyone looking for anything I got here? I got some cool kitchen stuff. Wait, he wants an old toaster for $40? I have a new toaster. I'll give it to you for 20 He's like, no, want old one. <laughs> I like the taste of rust on my toast. In Greenview 113. Are you serious? Yeah, We're continuing this trend of going to the next house in line? I'm gonna leave the coffee machine and the toaster here because they're heavy and I'm sure someone will eventually want good quality appliances on that internet thing. Like, I don't get it. It seems to be they just get off on the thrill of buying stolen shit. Like, you could get it cheaper in the pawn store or are new basically, but no, they're like, oh, feck yes, stolen toaster. <laughs> hey, Mike, that's a nice toaster. Thanks, it's stolen. <laughs> it's just what's in right now. Here we are, 113. I gotta break your toilet for some reason. God knows what. Dodgy plumbers, I suppose. Oh, god damn it, I broke my lockpick. I didn't know I could break it. God damn it, you know what? Oh, I'm stuck behind the window. Uh, how am I lagging on this game? Why is it so intensive? Just gotta break your toilet if I can get past all this lag. There you go. And, uh, I wanna steal something worthwhile. Microwave, I need this! Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus, where should I hide? Uh, where's the bedroom? I'll hide under their bed or something. Oh, wait, a printer. That'd be good. Shit, it's too heavy. <laughs> Just bring them right to- Oh, God, there's someone home! I think I threw a printer at him. Oh, why is it so laggy? I can't get out. Grace! What? How did you get in? The door was locked. I couldn't get in, and this is what I do for a living. Okay, but you know what? I'll just open the front window then. It'll be much faster. And that way I can get everything before the police arrive. No, not the printer. I don't want this. Uh, drop it! Feckin' hell! Did I say I was gonna be fast? I didn't mean to. Break the toilet. Done. Now we just get out of here. Can I go out this way? Will that work? Oh, that was easy. Alright, let's go home and sell ourselves a microwave. Maybe we can use it first. Make some nice popcorn. Or some microwaved hot chocolate. My guy seems like the kind of guy who'd enjoy that. 180 for a microwave, there you go. Why does someone want a damaged U phone? <laughs> Do you not want a, a good one? These people confuse the bejesus out of me. What's the most expensive item on this list that I can go out and try and steal? Oh, uh, you know what, I think it was, yeah, the guitar. Okay, it looks like that. It's like an acoustic style guitar. Yeah, I can go steal that. I'll go scope out the next house on my list, 114. The most predictable thief to never be caught. Well, I won't say never, I did get caught. But you know, in canon, I never got caught. Wait, why? I just showed up at your door. I could have been spreading the word of Jesus Christ for all you know. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I don't think I can get out of here. Oh Jesus. Freeze! Just kill me, dude. <laughs> My life is a bad one. What the- what the hell? You're, you're locked in the house now. Get out of here. <laughs> I'm trying to free them. <laughs> Officers, please. They're stuck in there. They're gonna suffocate. What kind of alarm system do they have? Jesus Christ. Look, I'm just here looking for my guitar, okay? I know you might think it's yours, but this is a communist country. Look, can you just point me in the direction of any guitars you may own? For sake, it's locked. What, what do you have behind there? A room of guitars, I bet. Alright, I'll just hide in their house. <laughs> See if the cops come get me. They just gave up. The people are like, but police officer, he's still in the house. Well, my shift's over, so I can't do nothing. <laughs> Just for pissing me off. Now you can't piss at all. Wait, how did you find me? Alright, I'll just go back and hide in your feckin' closet again. Been hiding in the closet for years. <laughs> it's really not gonna bother me. <laughs> Alright, I don't think I'm ever gonna find that guitar, and I think I'm gonna live out the rest of my days in this closet. So I think I'll end it there, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Never really know what to think with these games. Sometimes I expect them to just be horrible. I didn't expect it to be that good, but I really enjoyed it. But yeah, hope you enjoyed. Appreciate you as always, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.